Okay, okay, we're coming up on the highway. We gotta be quiet. All right, get, get down. <laughs> Jesus Christ! This is why you brought me out of here? Smell a bunch of goddamn freaks? Yeah. Okay, okay. Come on, follow him. Wait, wait, wait. Follow him? Where the hell are we going? Stay down. Just what the hell are we doing, Deke? This doesn't seem all that smart, even for a goddamn drifter. Hold up, hold up. You remember telling me about how the tourists used to flood up from California in the summer, choke off Highway 97 and the I-5 freeway? July, folks smelled almost as bad as these here freaks. Well, you weren't wrong about one thing. These freaks, the big groups, the ones that some call hordes, I think they're the reason we can't get their numbers down. What do you mean? Think about it, man. I've been out here in the shit collecting bounties for more than a year. Boozer too. Ricky, Schizo, a few others. How many freaks do you think I killed? A few. A few. Yeah, but their numbers never go down. You got a point? It's these whores. Every night, there's a steady stream of them up and down the Sandium Highway. Thousands of freaks pouring into the Lost Lake Valley, north of the Cascades. And you think they're coming up from California? Highway's closed off. No one's been south of the Sandium Pass in years. It's not closed off to the hordes. Freaks are the reason it's closed off. Anyway, the point I'm trying to make is that the hordes come in every night. Not a goddamn thing we can do to stop them. got that much right. Lost more than a few men trying to back in the day. Yeah, I know. I was there. And every horde that comes through leaves a few stragglers or gets busted up and scatters and, and just like that, freaks everywhere as far as the eye can see. You don't need to see them to know that they're around. We figure out a way to stop the hordes coming through, maybe we can make some headway, reduce their numbers. Make it safer. Free up more farmland, irrigation. Yeah. Okay, so how do we do that? You know goddamn well you can't take on a, a, a whatever you call it, a, a horde? This is how. I'll be goddamn. They stand there all day, hibernating or whatever the hell freaks do. So what are you thinking that we... Yep. We'll blow it the hell up. Stick it down to my there, there, and there. We'll bring down a mountain of rock. We seal this shit up. Yeah, so we trap a few hundred inside. What good is that gonna no, do? No, no, you don't get it. We seal this cave. Maybe they don't got no place to sleep. Or maybe this trail of piss and shit dries out, goes stale, and other stuff coming. Get my attention. Okay, come on, let's head back. All right, my knees are warmed up a bit. Let's see if you can keep up. Yeah, okay. Tell me. When does being out in the shit make you an expert on freaks? You spend your spare time just following them around, seeing what makes them tick? Not exactly. And how do you know about all this? About what a horde's gonna do, where they sleep? A few days ago, I was riding north of Belknap Crater when a chopper flew by. A chopper? What the hell? Just listen to me. It was a black chopper. One of those Nero choppers that used to fly all over the goddamn place when the shit was going down. And you saw one, still flying. I followed him. 
I stole one of their radios. I've been trying to track them down, see if they have a base around here. Supplies. Shit, I mean, see if the feds are still alive, you know what I'm saying? They're out here doing field work of some kind on the freaks. They're studying them. They got resources to do that while we're out here starving, fighting to stay alive. I followed them up to the grotto caves. You know the ones? Yeah. They had motion sensors set up, measuring how many freaks used the cave during the day, and, uh, Mike, it was thousands. That right. They said freaks all up and down the Cascade Range, south of Crater Lake, and north up to Smith Rock all used these lava tube caves to hibernate. So, we blew up those caves. Maybe we have a few less to deal with. Hey, this idea of yours, it's got some merit, but job like that, it's gonna take a fair amount of TNT. He said you wanted help making Lost Lake safer. This is how we do it. <sighs> All right. All right, look. There's some things I gotta do, okay? But you meet me at the bridge in a couple of minutes. I know where we can find some. St. John. You were supposed to be up at the farm an hour ago. My guy said he's got a shovel waiting for you. Yeah, Schizo, about that, I'm busy. See, Iron Mike and I, we're just heading out on a run. You and Iron Mike. You'll get your ass up that way today. Or you and your gimp boyfriend are gonna find yourselves out in the shit. You hear me? Without a goddamn battle. Yeah, yeah, I'll get right on that. St. John out. What do you want? You got something to say about it? <laughs> Howdy. Hey, you. Hmm, okay, good. That's all I got for now. Okay, where are we going? You know what they used to mine all around these parts? Yeah, uh, mercury or something. That's right, cinnabar. They extracted mercury from cinnabar. Folks back east think it was gold mines out here and silver. Not so. Back in the early 1900s, cinnabar was worth more than gold. To operate the mine, you need TNT for expansion, blowing out new tunnels, clearing cave-ins, that sort of shit. And to own TNT, you had to register with the county. Keep copies of the keys to all your lockboxes with the commissioner. Wait, the county courthouse? Where the hell is that? Thought you knew. It's in the old federal building. The old federal building? The one in Sherman's camp? Jesus, Mike. What the hell? You told me... You, you told me that you were never setting foot in that place again. Did I? I don't recall. You were drunk right after... Joe was killed. Did I tell you why? No. Here. Turn right here. This is it. Mike. The place is going to be crawling. I don't, I don't think this is a good idea. Uh, weather holds will be safe enough. All right. That there? It's the old federal building. That's where we're headed. 
Let's not go looking for trouble. Stay out of the buildings. Come on. We gotta head over this way. Where are we headed? Just follow me. He'll be on the commissioner. And and you know where he is? <laughs> where his body is? Yeah. I think I do. You heard what happened here. Yeah. Everybody got wiped out, man, woman, and child. Only a few got out, and, and uh, you, you were one of them, right? Only two got out. Me and Nora. But it wasn't the freaks that took us out. What do you mean? Here. In. The ammo was gone. Two sides called a truce. A meeting. Right here. Oh, we knew what was coming. We knew what was coming and we were prepared. Fight didn't last long. But it was bad. They had ammunition left after all, and how they... Oh, hell, you can see what they did. Like I said, two people walked out of this town after all was said and done. Some days. I wish the hell one of them wasn't me. Commissioner's over there in the bean counter suit. Go get the key so we can get the hell out of here. You didn't give a damn about sealing the caves. You brought me here because you, you brought me here because you wanted me to see this. Not true. All right, you got the key. We're gonna go get the maps to those mines, just like I said, and we're gonna get more than enough TNT to seal every cave in the valley. Bullshit. You are right about one thing. I'm not sorry you've seen it. Not following you, Mike. I am talking about the war that's coming with the Rippers, the one that Schizo so hot for you. Cares how many die on either side. Never mind. Come on, let's get this done. Here's the door. The place locked is locked tight. up tight. Come on, gotta find a way upstairs. Smells like something died in here. Newts. Yeah, I smell them. Bad business. Never much like kids. They always tended to get on my nerves. It was always a sore spot between me and my Elizabeth. God rest her soul. <laughs> you didn't like kids. Wow, well, here I thought you liked everyone. Almost no one, point of fact. But I tolerate most. Even smart ass drifters. I guess not. Come on. Okay. All right. This is it. Now we got maps to every mine in the county showing where they stored their dynamite. Okay, come on. Hear that? Yeah. Were well, you expecting anyone? Nope. Do you have my back here? Hey, I don't like starting trouble, but I'll finish it if I have to. Stay behind me. Hey, 
I can take care of myself. I'm not saying you can't, but remember the last time that we were out in the shit. Yeah, like I said, I'm staying behind you. behind you. Turned around. Jesus, what a mess! Now you know why no one goes into Sherman's camp. Eddie finds out you're out here risking your ass like this, she's gonna be pissed. Now how would she find out about something like that? 
Not from me. So about the Rippers, why you wanted me to see that shit? No, Deke. I always saw a bit of myself in you. Back in the day. How's that? You don't give a shit. Oh, you care about your friend. Don't want to see him die, but me? Any other goddamn person on the planet? I don't think so. Caring will just get you killed. Yeah, that's right. Thing is, not caring will get you killed just as easy. The good folks of Sherman Camp did would stop caring about anyone but themselves and their own. Easy to kill a man when he's just some piece of meat standing between you and what you need. Schizo wants to kill Rippers because he don't think they're human anymore. They don't count. They're standing in the way of what he wants. Well, I don't buy into that shit. I won't have it. You know, Schizo, he, uh, he wonders why I'm a pacifist. That's, you know, that's what he likes to call me. He, uh, he thinks I'm gonna get everybody killed. Well, are you, Mike? Are you gonna get everyone killed? Freaks aren't gonna be around forever. Now, when they're gone, we're gonna need some folks around here to help pick up the pieces. Hey, look, hey, hey. I don't like Carlos and his Rippers any more than I like Tucker or, or, or Copeland and his, his, his goddamn truthers. All right, but here, look. Here's the thing, Deke. I'm not going out of my way to kill any of them. I've had my share of killing. Even if Carlos comes for you, My truce will hold. You can bet on that. Truce ain't gonna hold. Now, yeah, for once, I agree with Schizo. The Rippers. They ain't human. Not anymore. I wonder how Boozer's holding up. I guess I should uh, go check on him. Hope he's awake. going, brother? No, Deke. I don't know about you, but, uh, I could use a hand. Uh, <laughs> you lay down. 
<laughs> I just may have. You can't have visitors just yet, but uh, I could really use a hand. Yeah, I'll see you later. I'll be here. Hey, Doc, Doc, seriously, though. Um, will I be able to play piano after all this is over? Very funny, William. Lay down. <laughs> okay. I could play chopsticks. No, seriously, I could. I'd be like... <laughs> As you can see, he's going to be just fine. His fever's completely gone. Good, that's good. All right, well, I gotta go take care Deacon, of some shit. like I said before, William really does owe you his life. Boozer doesn't owe me shit. I owe him. Hey, I saved two more. Eddie and Mia would have died without those antibiotics. I just thought you should know. Seems like he's uh, getting better. Ricky, what's going on? That guy we've been looking for, Eric Lynch, who, who murdered Camel and Reed at the farm. Lynch, man. Son of a bitch. You know where he is? Yes, uh, yeah. He's on the north shore at the old boat launch. Schizo wanted to go after him, but Iron Mike said to get you. I'll get to him. Thanks, Deke. Hurry. And you got another job for me, so okay, I'll stop by, digging out. Deke, is this Cope? You out there? Copeland, yeah, yeah, I'm here. I'm uh, guessing you uh, got another job for me. Okay, I'll swing by, digging out. Deke, we need him alive. Alive? Oh, come on. No, why? Before he ran, he stole two bags of seed. Deke, we need those seeds. Ah, shit. We need to know where he sold them or stashed them. You're making my day a lot more complicated. Okay, fine. I'll chase him down. Deacon out.
out of the infirmary today, man. And he said she'd heard enough of my whining to last her a lifetime. <laughs> Sounds like Addy. How's the arm? You know, it's about 50% there. <laughs> Sorry, a little amputee humor there. But seriously, though, it's like I can still feel my right hand, you know? Yeah, I think they call that phantom pain. Yeah, yeah, that's what Addy said. It, it fucking sucks. Yeah, it doesn't look I too bad. pain in my finger joints, you know? Like, after a long ride, your hand gets cupped up. You want to flex it. And... Anyway, I, I gotta get going. This has got me on farm duty. I'm gonna see if I can uh, lay off these damn pain meds that Addy has me on. Later. That's it. Later. Still got the Oh shit, there he is. Commitments, man, come on! Oh no, you're not gonna get away. How's it going, Lynch man? What, is the camp not feeding you well enough? Fuck you! Thought you just kill a couple guys right off with our shit? Don't matter if a bunch of folks here die of starvation because you got what you need, right? <laughs> Get off of me, you son of a bitch! Hey, 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 listen to me. Rick is gonna send some men for you. You tell them where you stash the seeds, maybe they'll just shoot you, you know, instead of hanging you slow. What do you think about that? I don't know what the hell you're talking about! Okay, man, suit yourself. Hey, Ricky, here. I got him. And I'll uh, send you his position. Send someone out here to pick me. him up. Does he have the seeds on his bike? Wait. 
Please, I can fix this. Don't leave me here. No, no, I didn't see him. All right, we'll bring him in. Lost Lake out. See? Right. You send some men to go out and get him? Yeah, he's a lot more cooperative all of a sudden. Evidently, our guys got to him just before a swarm. They offered to leave him where he was if he didn't tell him where the seeds were. Oh, so weird. <laughs> yeah, I, I really would have just left him there to rot. Yeah, you know what Iron Mike would say about that? Yeah, 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 I know. See you, Ricky. Should have more stuff later. All right, see you, Deke. Good to see you, Deke. Hey, Damon. How's life? St. John, I got a bounty job for you. I'm listening. You're looking for Ned Walker. Wears a red scarf. He and his crew came to the gate the other night. We wouldn't let him in. He killed one of my guards and took off. Hmm. You have someone to follow him? He's holed up at a marauder camp just north of O'Leary Mountain. I think you know where that is. No, but I'll find him. How have you been? Hey, Damon. How's the gun trade going?
fuel can. scrap. Cope, uh, the man he killed, who was it? A young kid. Everyone called him Gopher. Never knew his real name. Gopher. How old was he? Like I said, a kid. 19, 20? No idea how he lasted this long. But he was a good kid. Why are you asking? No reason. If you spent more time at the camp, got to know folks, maybe you'd find a reason. Cope out. I saw something. I saw someone.
Yep, it's done. You won't be hearing from that walker again. Bring me his bandana. I want to see it for myself. Go about. Yeah, of course you do. What's up, bro? Oh. What up? You ready for round two? Let's go. I didn't know if you were enjoying it, but I see you streaming. Nah, I'm on stream with this thing. Oh yeah, Mike, I found him. You know me, I don't, I don't need that torch on this camp. Shit, hold up, the pizza man called me. Uh. Hello? Yes, this is Fidas Pizza, I have a delivery for you I'm right here in front of the apartment complex. Okay, I'll come out right now. Thank you. Thank you. I'll be right. Ah, it's the pizza. The el hombre. Que momento le. Tres. No, no, so tres. I'll tell you what it is. There's a large combination with a small pep on the side. No, two, two combination with a something like that. Watch. It's two combinations. Or it's like I don't know what it is, dude. To be honest, but I've heard him say it so many times that I forgot. It's too. It's a large combination with a small pep on the side and an extra pepperoni pizza. Watch, there it is. It's something like that. Watch. Watch. You know it like at the back of my head. Back of my palm. Get one of those other warlock with that. You know what I'm remembering right now too? You know when we played her against Crafty, I was playing with the Warlock. And that was before this fucking... I played Rocket League the other day and I played against a clan that was called Daddy Daycare. I said it's all on the sign you. Should have been like, I got a free agent right here with you guys. I was gonna ask him, what's the rules to join the clan? Is there a kid limit? Taking care of strippers' babies. I'm pretty sure they have their family members doing it already. Dude, do they have? Ah, now a lot. With all these apps and shit. Yeah, not daycares, nannies. Well, say you're looking for a thing like <laughs> when they take a rig to the, the planet, they don't want the rig. <laughs> they leave it with the other rigs. You remember that episode? Oh, no, no, the, the rigs, the other Jerry's. <laughs> Dude, that episode was funny as fuck. And. <laughs> And then they got the wrong Jerry. I think we got your Jerry. <laughs> What's up? Oh yeah, I know. He told me. I'm gonna take. We'll go watch it. You still got the free coupons? You still got the free coupons? We'll go watch it sometime this week. So we gotta watch both? 
my god. I don't know if I can do it, Leslie. Oh. My sister says she's disowning my brother because he's gonna go watch uh, the Avengers right now. No, my brother, he's gonna go watch it. No, it's just, it's just we got this. Yeah. Yep. You got the, you got a, the combination with the extra medium pep and a small cheese or no? Nope. Where was it? No, not today. I switched it up today. What'd you get today? Uh, I got the meat lovers. Oh my god. Oh, did you, what'd you get? Richmond Pizza House? No, uh, Phoenix. I never tried their meat lovers, so I just wanted to try it today. They got a meat lovers? Yeah, I was looking at the menu, and I saw it on I there. I didn't know they had a meat lovers. I didn't know either. Oh, let me try this shit. It looks pretty good. Deacon, you there? Another job came up. I was going to get that shit, bro, yeah, but I wasn't uh, trying to argue okay. with them, nigga. I'll stop by. Stay John out. The Richard Pizza House? Says, nah, uh... From Fina is when I try to use that coupon for the extra large combination and the free small cup. Uh. Cause that nigga says I gotta order the toppings separately. What? Yeah, that's what he said. And I'm like, bro, like nigga, I've been ordering from, for ten years from that place. They ain't never told me that shit. That shit don't make sense though. Why is he gonna? What are you gonna order the toppings on the side? Yeah. I think it's a combination. It comes with hella toppings, so. Nigga, what are you nice talking work. about? Lost more than a few men. I'm running a holler in. Next stick time, that just come mouth. to me. You volunteering? No, I'm about to send you a picture of the meat lovers. Boy, that shit looks smack. I ain't even gonna fake. bike. Go see man. That's not it. You got enough camp credits. He'll fix you right up. Like, yeah, there's only a little bit of time left. Oh, where did he order that? What's the piece of time about? It's smacking now. That's oh, cool. I like it. Uh. <laughs> ain't, ain't bad. Ain't too You're bad. Back. That was from Firehouse, though, or whatever. I might start ordering from there, though, to be honest, because, uh, Phoenix is getting expensive, boy. 